and welcome to the channel. I'm Miranda, Mrs. Thinking of a Master Plan, and I am here with my monthly plan with me in my Wrong Wrong Planner. Before we jump into the video, just a few reminders along with some announcements. So first and foremost, if you enjoy the video um, or the kit or anything about this, make sure you show your girl some love by giving me the thumbs up. Um, comment below, what did you think of the kit? And when you think of fall, are you like me? You just get so tired of the orange and the green and the brown that you wanna lighten things up a little bit. Um, let me know below how you feel about that. And last but not least, if you have not had the opportunity to join the channel, make sure that you hit that red subscribe button below along with the great notification bell right next to the subscribe button. And boom, boom, bam, just like that, you will be a member of Team Bella. Okay, so first things first. I know today is Tuesday and I did not have a motivational Monday on yesterday, which was Monday the first of se um the second of September. And also I did not have a POB video today. So guys, um I am still struggling <laughs> with um my stomach after coming back from being in Nicaragua. So I'm not a hundred percent myself, but I really wanted to get up and share with you guys. Um, what I attempted to do for the happy planner in terms of a monthly kit this month. Um, something else I wanted to remind you is if you have not had the opportunity to purchase your tickets to our planner verse event that's happening on October 19th, where we will have two special guests, Shea Budgets and E. Michelle, the budget misses, and they will be putting on a, um, a training, if you will. Um, we have some silhouette training, wonderful swag, and just a good time. So I hope that if you're close to North Carolina, South Carolina, Georgia, and surrounding areas, come on down and join us. We would love to have you here. We're going to have so much fun. Um, there will be a giveaway towards the end of this week. So probably on Saturday, on the Nietzsche Saturday video, I will be announcing those details of the giveaway. All right, so let's jump into this plan with me. So I am loving fall in terms of decorations and everything, but I do find that it's too orange and brown and green for me sometimes. So any breaking up or variation of that, I, I, I'm i here for it. So with that in mind, I decided to create me a monthly kit. And yes, it's foiled because your girl loves foil. Now, this is the first time I've ever made one for the Happy Planner. Do you guys see that lovely, lovely silver foil? I'm loving it. Um, and I wanted to take it pastel because, of course, the for the month of September here in this Wrong Wrong Planner, it's lavender and I didn't want to cover it all up. So I'm going to just get started and let's see um, what we can do here. Now, I'm sure there will be some lessons learned as I see one already. <laughs> as I'm making these kits, um, I'm just doing some um, demonstration, if you will, so that when uh, my shop opens back up, it was supposed to be open back on August the 15th, but with all the travel for work, it was just impossible to do so. All right, it will help if you lay it straight. Now I will tell you, if you do purchase stickers from my shop when it opens, I do use premium matte and it is, it feels like butter, but it'll tear like butter as well. So let me try this another way. I hope you guys can see what I'm doing here. Just trying to line this area up. My hands are shaking. And that's just because your girl cannot really, ginger ale, that's been my best friend since I've been back. Ginger ale, so not a lot of food in the belly. Okay, oh, I think that's pretty. Tell me what you think. I'm going to grab my uh, Uniball Signo and there's a couple of places where the um, pink on the page on these bows on those heels are peeking out. That is absolutely gorgeous. I love it. Okay, so let's try the other side and let's see how I did with that. You know, sometimes when you're getting these measurements down for the first time, um, you know, you can have some challenges. I know I do, I can't speak for anybody else. But I can tell you, 
that your girl is feeling. Feeling this. Okay, I know that I'm gonna have to bring it up a little. It's got a little gap. I don't know if you can see it there. But hopefully if I put this ruler in here and try to bring it up, it'll just come up and oh yeah okay y'all that is so pretty i love it i love it it's so cute okay now let's see the sidebar what i have and i have two equal parts of the sidebar to cover up this notes here so let's, I probably should have done it so that it came all the way up or maybe all the way down. And I want to line it up with that one. Are we hanging off the page? No. But I fear that it's a little short. And if it is, and I know why it's short. It's short because I'm going to reposition it the way that I anticipated it to go. I never anticipated it to, I didn't design it to be all the way up here. So I'm going to use some undo on it so I can pull it down. I, I rather it have an opportunity here on the very top of the page. Look at me, a previous undo situation there. Can I pull it on up without bending my page or tearing my planner? Yes, I can. All right, let's see. Okay, there still is a little gap, but I'm not worried about the gap because I do have some um, Simply Gilded Washi that we can use to break that up just a little bit. I still think it's pretty and I like it. Okay. So let's go and check these boxes here on the bottom and let's see how we're going to set it up. I think I wanna bring this one with the foil in on it. Let's see. You know what? I forgot date dots. So I need to grab my date dots because I wanna put silver date dots down on this. And the way I picture this is to have foiled, not foiled, foiled, not foiled was the plan. So let's see how my plan turns out. And I don't know why I was gonna say I'm missing one. I'm not, I got this cute little foiled one right here. It is so cute with the three pumpkins. one well it should have been two more but it's okay wait a minute I think I just lost my mind briefly I'm going to pull these up let's see what happens can it come right up or am I going to need undo well actually it's coming out fairly easy so let's go ahead and line these up Okay, this one as well, because I'm certain that September does not have 29 days in it. All right. So. Let's try this now. 
<laughs> now, here we go. I just got thrown off because I totally forgot to pull out some silver date dots. And we are gonna pull those out. And I should have known. We need some little silver date dots. Okay, much better. I'm loving it. So we're gonna grab these date dots from Sarah Elizabeth Prince. I'm going to fast forward this portion and I will be right back. Okay, so we have our date dots down and I can tell you that those are gorgeous. All right, so let's see what else we can do here. So I have some build do stickers, some flags um, to just indicate various things. Okay, so I'm tripping. I needed to put these on fr on Friday, not Saturday. So I think I should have started this on Sunday. My dates are off. Oh, that sucks. No, my dates are not off. Yes, my dates are off because Sunday was the first day of the month. So I think I should have did Sunday, Monday, Tuesday, Wednesday, but because I did Monday, Tuesday, Wednesday, everything is one day off and I'm going to fix this and I will be right back with you. Okay, so I went in and tried to fix everything that I had messed up. So learned a good lesson. We're gonna just use the silver um, washi here to kind of cover up some that I feel like it's just best if I cover up with washi, silver washi, because I don't want anything on here that is going to like clash a little bit. So that's what I'm doing where I had to replace the holidays. But this is a good lesson because I know there are certain planner babes that love their week to start on Monday. So I'm not one of those planner babes. This was a total accident. So yes. Oops. Let's see. Can we can we make it up? Can we make it look good? I think we can. I think overall with the little tweaks on the kit, it will work. Um I think that when I do reopen the shop, I want to do some monthly kits and this is telling me that I think I will do a pretty good job at a monthly kit. Small tweaks, small tweaks are definitely needed. And I'm gonna move this so I can put some um, silver washi tape on this side of the spread because we have none. We have none, none, none. So we just put this here. So cover that. And I think that I can take this. This is kind of hollow, but I want to see how it'll look if I lined it up on this side. Will it look crazy? I don't think so. I think it looks cute with the vertical bows. And I don't even think I'm gonna go all the way up the page. I think I'm gonna stop here. Okay, so I decided to take that washi off. So in the comments below, let me know if you think I should have left the green washi or maybe put silver. Um, I love how this turned out. I think it's absolutely cute. Um, I will be making some small but necessary tweaks for the kit next week, next month for the month of October. So um, one would be to make this um, sidebar taller and wider so it'd reach here 
and maybe making um, this a little thicker and having this go all the way to the edge of the page. Just little things and then making these boxes just a tad bit smaller. But other than that, um, I think it's great. I think it's a great variation of, you know, the the traditional fall kits that we see out and about now or the traditional fall look. I'm loving the pastel pumpkins. Okay, guys. Well, if you enjoyed the video, make sure you do the three things. Like, comment, and subscribe. I'll see you in the next video. Ciao, Bella.